Yeah, it's, a, it's a, as you can see, we're all happy, especially after what we did on Saturday against Denmark. We had to, we had to put it right. Uh, we knew we were a group that was better than what we showed against Denmark, and um, I'm just happy we, we proved to everyone that we are a good young team and we can compete. And you mentioned a lot of you guys mentioned on the back line that communication is something that that needed to be worked with. How was it? How was it better tonight? Uh, I just felt that we, we we gave calls a lot earlier. You know, we saw especially one with Eddie Johnson, arguably two of the best strikers in MLS. So we knew if we didn't communicate, they were they were going to kill us and make it a tough night. So we just decided we would speak. For no reason, if it makes sense, just talk and just so we knew where we were at all times. For you personally, how did it feel to to play well against some of these these better U.S. strikers and, and MLS strikers? For me, it's it was important because I've been away from uh, players like that for a while, so it was good to get get back in it. Uh, I got a good hour and bit under my belt, so I, I was pretty pleased with my performance. And so, for you personally, right now, if I know there was an option and a possible vibe, what's sort of your status with with MLS or you know your Playing club status. Yeah, it's um, again things have. I don't know what has happened since I spoke with Jerry Dobson the other day. I, I haven't taken any phone calls, so I was focused on this game. But as you said, I do have uh, an option, so I'm still on the contract. So we'll see what happens. And but are you now joining up with with San Jose in, in Arizona, or what happens? Uh, not until uh, things are sorted. Not until things are sorted yeah. out. All right.